So following a pretty solid Survivor Series, um, the next night on Sunday evening, the day after the Survivor Series, WWE did a house show. Or, uh, you know, they were on a live event in Peoria, Illinois. Today, I'm going to give you the results of that. I'm going to start covering live events, superstars, all of that as much as I can for you guys. I'm, and because the reason I'm definitely doing it today is because some things happen and it causes, you know, causes you marks to talk. I'm JB Gunner. And this is Heel Nation. Let's go ahead and get into it. All right, continuing on with the show here today, guys, we're going to be talking about the house show live results that happened on November 26, 2023. Now, if you guys didn't know, I'm sure you do. The Survivor Series was on November 25th. CM Punk returned a lot of backstage stuff. You know, uh, a lot of people think are shoots when they're not. Seth Rollins, Drew McIntyre, all of that stuff uh, last night, actually, in a lot of ways, showed you that it was anything but a shoot. Guys, real quick, if you guys would, thumbs up, share, subscribe, hit the links down below, do all that good shit. But let's talk about this. WWE live results. What I want to do first and foremost is I want to, uh, you know, confirm. I've told you guys that I believe that the Seth Rollins, Drew McIntyre, all of that stuff regarding the return of CM Punk was a complete shoot. And last night confirmed it for me because... Seth Rollins, your world champion, the one of the faces of the WWE, you think he went rogue and picked up a mic on his own and began to badmouth CM Punk? Triple H's newest signing, you think so? And then you think Drew McIntyre, another face of the company, you see him right here, he just cuts a promo at a house show? Guys, you're being hornswoggled. That is what is happening right now. In fact, let's just go ahead and take a listen. Seth Rollins. <laughs> I'm not going to waste any more breath on somebody who's been gone for eight years and has done nothing but try to tear this place down. That's it. I'm going to take my time. I'm wasting my breath. Use my breath. I'm talking about the people who've been here all along. I'm talking about them in the back who've been giving me the hot ticket down. That's every single you can't tell that he's talking in his in character. Drew McIntyre, he also talked in character. Watch the show, you know why? You know what? When the world's heavyweight match recently, War Games last night, my stupid team lost the match for me. You've heard things probably on the internet. Not a great place. My stupid team lost the match for me. You understand it's scripted, right? This is fake. Wrestling is fake. These are promos. But there's one thing that can turn this frown upside down, that can change things for me. It's getting that world title, and I can't think of anywhere better than for Big D to finally raise his first world title for the live fans. <laughs> how do you not? How do you not see it? It takes shit's head. You see, I'm gonna kick it like a field goal. I learned a lot about American football recently. But Seth, I'm gonna break his back, make him humble, kick his ass, and take that. He dropped some Iron Sheik shit. So I'm going to break his back and make him humble. I love it. After party, it's going to be huge. Go for 21. Get out of the town. Buy Big Mac a shot. Big Mac, that's me. Buy me a shot because we're partying all night long. Man, motherfuckers don't cut promos like that, especially if they're not on the card. They don't cut promos like that. You know what I mean? Clearly... The, the WWE has decided that Seth Rollins and Drew McIntyre are going to be involved in the CM Punk return as a, you know, you understand kayfabe, right? Anyway, you can look at my last video for more on that. But I do want to give you the results of this because the thing I like about house shows and live events, they kind of show you what's going to happen in the future and, you know, kind of what they're working on, right? But let's go over to Peoria, Peoria Illinois, um, Live results. Here they go. Uh, L.A. Knight fought Grayson Waller to a no contest due to interference. L.A. Knight then and Kevin Owens as a tag team defeated Grayson Waller and Austin Theory. So, you know, 
Not really anything, no major storylines going on there, but there could be in the future. I don't think LA Knight and Kevin Owens are going to be a tag team. Let's just say that. But Grayson Waller, awesome theory. They're already called A-Town down under. Uh, then we had a women's championship match. EO Sky defeat, defeated Charlotte Flair and Bianca Belair to retain the title. Remember, this is the night after. This is the night after... Um, uh, Survivor Series. Cody Rhodes then went on to defeat The Miz. That's interesting to me. So do they have The Miz back as a heel? I thought The Miz had made a face turn. Cody Rhodes, the biggest face in the company, went against The Miz. Bobby Lashley and the Street Profits defeated the LWO in Dragon Lee. So I wonder who was the LWO. Is that is that uh, Cruz Del Toro and Joaquin Wilde in Dragon Lee? Becky Lynch then once again defeated she defeated Zoe Stark. They've had her their thing going on. I bet that was a pretty good solid match. Um, and then the World Heavyweight Championship match, Seth Rollins defeated Shinsuke Nakamura and Drew McIntyre. So Drew McIntyre and Seth Rollins was on the show. This is the night after. You don't find it a little ironic that they have Seth Rollins and Drew McIntyre running the house show circuit together? And Shinsuke Nakamura, who was waiting on a mystery guy to come into the company, making all kinds of hints, including doing a G GTS. Come on. Pay attention to everything, including house shows. And you, it, 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 you know, one plus one equals two. One plus one equals two. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think. You guys are being worked. Some of you get it, and some of you understand kayfabe. Clearly, they're setting up a Seth Rollins, Nakamura, Drew McIntyre, and ultimately CM Punk type of program. Clearly, they've, they've, they've grouped all these people together for a reason. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. If you want to support channel, links are down below. See you guys next video.